the automotive industry is heading into an area of a very integrated cockpit. You can't have safety systems that are completely separated from your navigation system or from your cluster. They have to work together. The need is there for a high-level OS, but that high-level OS has to be able to cross the boundaries of infotainment and active safety. So I believe Cunix is uh, well positioned to be the OS for the cockpit. We are a real-time operating system. We have the right safety certifications. We have the heritage on the infotainment systems, and we have everything in between. So with the Toyota Highlander, we're actually trying to blend together the key elements of the traditional instrument cluster, infotainment features, as well as safety systems into a single unified platform. With our design, we've tried to eliminate all unnecessary information. We've studied and looked at what information is critical for the driver, made sure it was there when it's critical, and it's not there when it's not needed. This allowed us to create a very clean and minimalistic interface, which is both safe and aesthetically beautiful. The Highlander is an excellent car to demonstrate in-cabin communication. In a seven-seater car with three rows, it's very hard, especially while driving at high speeds down the highway, to speak from the back seat to the front seat. So from a safety perspective, having in-cabin communication means the driver can stay focused on the task of driving while communicating to passengers in the back. So ICC is yet another technology that Cunix is adding to our acoustics portfolio to enhance the experience of audio within the vehicle. In the past we've used the Jeep as a reference platform. Now we're looking to extend the Jeep to include not only infotainment features, but also showcase our new Cunix platform for ADAS. What we're bringing to the table with this platform is a safety certified operating system, vision algorithm accelerators, a camera framework, that will allow the integration of LiDAR, radar, and camera inputs. The idea is to provide value to our customers so that they can quickly develop active safety systems. And of course, Cunix is perfect for that. In the Jeep, we're showing augmented reality running on a screen directly in front of it, simulating to a driver what they might be seeing on a next generation HUD. What this allows us to do is to display navigation information as if it were painted on the road, but it's fully dynamic. So since we are able to move information such as points of interest, turn-by-turn -turn directions, up into our augmented reality system, we can reserve the cluster for information such as speed, tack, and safety warnings. This blend allows us to really make use of all the space in front in the driver's vision. What Cunix is doing is fostering an ecosystem which provides a stable and secure platform for all of these companies to develop their ADAS systems on top of. So this platform and ecosystem will allow us to build the next generation ADAS systems, but it'll also pave the way for semi-autonomous as well as autonomous drive in the years to come. Vita-X is a new technology that allows for the direct communication both between vehicles as well as between vehicles and infrastructure such as traffic lights and intersections. VTX is critical for autonomous drive. Without VTX, safety might be compromised, the ability to control traffic congestion would be minimized. So VTX is a very important component of autonomous drive. Part of the challenges of VTX is the vehicles need to be in motion to be able to demonstrate it, which is a challenge in a static environment. So we're using the, the command center to drive scenarios to make the vehicles think that they're in motion. In this demonstration, we use a top-down view of various real-world scenarios. This allows us to display the status of multiple vehicles at once. We can show how this V2V information would actually be communicated to a driver and how the driver would react. I believe Cunix's role will be the operating system for the automobile, from ADAS systems, autonomous drive, clusters, telematics, acoustics, and infotainment. We will dominate the cockpit of the car.